they really echo Ghislaine's lawyer's rhetoric that Ghislaine was vulnerable and taken advantage of by Epstein and painting her as really just another one of his victims. Yeah, this is from uh, Christine, actually, who is, I say, like, mid-rare. Mid-rare. Yeah. Mid-rare Maxwell. She's no Isabel. No Isabel. Isabel is everywhere, or was everywhere. Um, And this is what she wrote. We live in a world where malicious envy of people seem to have wealth and perceived quote, undeserved social position in life is perfect fodder for selling newspapers and filling social media platforms with gaudy, single-faceted views. Ghislaine had money because she worked very hard to earn it. Her positions demanded hard, diligent work, great intelligence, great management skills, great ability to get on well with people from all walks of life, artistic creativity, and caring about others. Her work was a far cry from the Flippity gibbet socialite label, citation, please, that the media has decided to cast on her every time they reference her. Flippity gibbet, but I never. So flippity gibbet, flippity, flippity, (laughs) flippity gibbet is actually, have been referenced by Ghislaine's team several, I think she was called a flippity gibbet socialite at some point. By who? I don't, the, I'm sure the, the Daily Mail or something. Um, and they really just like- They that really seems, latched onto that. Uh, that seems like the most hurtful thing anyone's ever- That's like the- that's Dude, like, we've 100% called her like a dumb fucking bitch, like hoe yeah. bag, stupid but, fucking cunt or whatever. Yeah. And you're going to go with flippity gibbet? Well, I got to say to a certain kind of white English woman, flippity gibbet is basically worse than whatever slur is going through your mind right now. If you say flippity gibbet uh, on a on a guard at a garden party uh, near the Thames, oh my god! I mean, you'll be run out of there on a fucking lawn. At a Tarts I mean, and Vickers oh party, my god. yeah, exactly. If you're at the Queen's Head Pub in Knightsbridge, and you fucking you <laughs> if fucking, you flip a flippity gibbet, yeah, oh all my gibbets god, will flip. If you, yeah, if it's listen, if you tell if you tell one of the nags at the horse race. And you're, you know, you're there in your your garden hat and your sun uh, umbrella, and you're like fucking a lot of flippity gibbets around here. Someone will, I, I shit you not, probably strike you dead with a rapier, pierce you through the heart. <laughs> 